Anyway. Let's go in. So... Oh, never mind. Oh, no, no, yeah, I was right. I was gonna say, I thought the rock would be, like, somewhere here, but... No, it's just over there. What happens when I do this? <laughs> Hi, Mario. I figure I'll have an adventure sooner or later, so I'm training. What's that? Dry Dry Desert? Oh, sure, there's a train that goes there from Toad Town. Hey, maybe I'll tag along. No, you sure? Just give me a chance. What? He wants to tag along? Well, let's get him along, come on! I'll have to adventure sooner or later, so I'm training. What's that thing? Oh, sure, it is. Oh, okay, never mind. I mean, of course, this is Paper Mario, not Paper Mario and Luigi. It's not Mario and Luigi game, you know? <laughs> anyway, let's look at if we have any mail. I don't know what it will do, but... Little T. Dear Mario, how do you do? I'm Little T, I'm just a little toad. I live in Toad Town. I've been training at the dojo so I can save Princess Peach. I'll write to you again later. Bye. Oh, it's short. Oh, look. You rat, Mario. How dare you embarrass us. I'll never forget what you did, Red. Hey, watch your back when you walk at night. Not black. I'm gonna make you cry, Green. You'd better sleep with one eye open, pal. Yellow. We shall return, Koopa Bros. They're not lying, they will show up sooner or later, but it's a, in a funny way and, and stuff. But it's actually weird though, because it's like, if you go down to where they fell and stuff, you see them trapped and stuff and everything, and they are trapped because there's like, they had to, someone like reconstructed the hole and stuff, so they're kind of trapped and stuff, but not forever, they will escape, but you know. It's kind of weird that they sent the letter just now and stuff, but you know. Yeah. So anyway. We got some items, um, I'm gonna go get some badges, actually. I know I should have maybe not spent money on those things, but they're very cheap, so I don't think it'll be that big of a deal. Toad Town News Flash. More Mario, more than match for the Kuba Bros Fortress. Our hero Mario has bankers the Kuba Bros that live in the Great Fortress to the East. Kuba Bros, long time under Lincoln Bowser, had been left to guard one of the kidnapped star spirits. That star spirit has returned to Star Haven, all thanks to our hero, Huzzah for Mario. Anyway. Oh yeah, the the store. Hey, m hey, mister. My dad's opened his shop. Don't you want to take a look? It's really cool. It's a bad shop for badges. Come on, check it out. Yeah, definitely. I want to see what, what you got. We have lots of rare badges, so take a very close look. So, D down pound. Disable an enemy's defense power and injures it. Multi-bounce. Jumps on all enemies in a row if action command is timed right. Speedy spin. Increases the distance bar you can spin dash. Oh, that actually would be really fast and convenient, but I'm not going to I, I want to save some money, so I'm not going to use it. Oh, look. So, this is another area in order to get to the next world, but it's much later. Water and dirt, sunshine power, beautiful blooms, beautiful flowers. Hello, my name is Mint... Min tea. Oh, like min tea. Okay. Please enjoy the beauty of this flower garden. I've heard there's a lovely flower, flower we don't have here. Supposedly bu bubbles have the only known seeds. This is what a bubble looks like. If you find a bubble, could you get, get seeds for me? I'll plant them in this flower garden and raise them lovingly. So you actually have to find these guys and get their seeds, because it's the only way to get to the next level. And there is one, not too far from here. Just... right... here. <laughs> Puff! Well, hello there. My name is Bubble. I came from, from Flower Fields, the wonderful land of flowers. I'd love to sp spread the wondrous flowers of, of Flower Fields all over your land. You like flowers, don't you? Of course you do. Who doesn't? For that reason, I'll entrust this to your care. You got the magical seed. A seed ha have not planted in the flower garden in Toad Town. That is a flower seed. If it's well cared for, a beautiful flower will bloom. These flowers are delicate. Only one with a loving heart can make them bloom in beauty. Please take good care of it, for beauty is fragile. Anyway. Oh, and when you go this way, that's how you get to the forest. Beyond here lies dark, dark and gloomy floor of a forest. You'll get lost for sure, so I advise you not to enter. You have to enter, but not right now, so, you know. 
Anyway, so yeah, I don't know if so the bright one silver lining to if I was rejected by USF, I could get I could move to the state of Massachusetts like faster or some other state, maybe Colorado. And then I could play Persona 3, like replay Persona 3 for you guys and you know, then do the Fuka route, which I'm really hoping I'd be able to do in my lifetime, you know? Yeah. Uh, hello, is same thing. I've heard there's a lovely flower we don't have here. Supposedly bubbles have uh, they look like this. If you find a bubble, you guys see it for me. I'll plant them in Oh shit, I didn't need to read it. Uh oh whatever. Oh you'll give me the seed? Thank you, I really appreciate it. I'll plant it right away. <laughs> that's all you do to plant. So that's one. If you get three more, then you get to a new world. Anyway, so... Oh, that's the sewer. Private. I'm not gonna do it now because I want to keep on going. You, I will do this area, but it'll be much later, you know? So you have to go south in order to get to the train station. What is this? Oh yeah. Oh wait. Yeah, I remember. This goes to a game place, right? Oh yeah, this is a game place. Let's ask him. Oh. Hello there, Mario. Welcome to the playroom. Play here, you need to member credit. The kind of game you can play depends on the kind of member credit you have. Oh, I'm not doing it. I just remember I, I remember there was a pipe here and you do it like that, so. Oh, I wanna do this. Cause it's probably pretty fun. I love little oinks, love them. You, you want to learn about them? Yes, little oinks are timid and mysterious creatures that hatch from eggs. They spook easily and will Run away if you approach them. Observe them from out here. There are many breeds of little oinks. They're very easy to tell apart. White ones, black ones, even gold ones and silver ones. If you're curious about the breed of a newborn little oink, come over to talk to me. I wish the world were full of little oinks. That would be grand. Huh, <laughs> little oinks. I'm gonna do one. Welcome to that famous little oink farm. Hit the bar overhead to pay 10 coins and wait for the egg hit to uh, yeah, hit, hit it with a hammer to hatch the little oink. Try to find out what kind of little oink will be born. Have fun watching those other little oinks. Be careful though, if someone gets inside the fence, all the little oinks will run away. You can have a maximum of 10 little oinks on the, on the farm. When the 11th little oink enters, the first will leave. Now try to see all of the different types of little oinks. Alright. Yeah, let's do it. That's so weird. Like, that does that make any sense? Like, why would there be... I know I'm taking this very seriously, but I'm just saying. It's a flower one. Oh, it's a flower little oink. Nice floral design. Huh. Is that all? Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll hatch another, like, after I, uh, complete the, uh, that so-called world I'm doing. Yeah, so... Just checking around. You can't do the train thing unless you have a ball ball, which I do have. What is this? It's like, why is there like a, whatever, it's like an empty place. And I go talk to him. I'm ruined, done for, a huge rock is blocking the train tracks. When Peach's castle was uprooted, one of the boulders from that stack rolled off and landed here. What a bad luck. If we can't do something about that boulder, I can't make my run to Mount Rugged. So, Peach's castle. Oh, okay, this is like, say, goes to Georgia Desert, I don't know. Oh, Luigi kind of mentioned it already, that it goes to... The train takes you to Georgia De Desert, so, you know. Oh, thank you, Mario, the train's back on track. All aboard, this train is bound from Mount Rugged. Are you coming, Mario? Yes. The train is about to depart, please board quickly. You don't need a ticket for it, it's, it's for free, unlike, say, Thousand Year Door. Sit tight, folks. Now departing from Mount Rugged. So, yeah. There it goes. There's a little cutscene here. I'm gonna keep it just for this part. Just for that part and then coming back. If I ever want to come back to this place again, then I'm going to 
skip this part, you know, so that it wouldn't take too long, you know? Now it's an hour in love with I'll stop sometime in hour 30 or an hour 40, I don't know. Chapter 2, The Mystery of Dry Dry Ruins. That's a chain chomp. <clears throat> Mount Rugged, meet Mount Rugged. Passengers heading for Dry Dry Desert or Dry Dry Outpost should proceed directly over Mount Rugged from the station. Look at this guy with the turban. If you want to go to Dry Dry you have to hike over Mount Rugged. Follow the arrows on the sunward so you don't get lost. There are a lot of scary creatures around here if you're not careful. You'll get hurt in a big way. If things are looking to spread, you'd better run away really fast. At least I would. So, now we can save. Anyway, so yeah, I guess now one thing and one more thing I want to talk about is like something about politics. Now I know that there's the vice presidential debate happening, but I want to talk about different politics because soon, I don't know when, sometime in the October 10s, not the October 10th, but the 10s kind of thing, the teens area, uh, there's going to be the New Zealand general election. And honestly, I don't, I don't really feel confident about how things are going to turn out. I really feel like Jack that that fucking cultural Marxist uh, Jaquita Ardern is going to win re-election. As a matter of fact, she's going to get a majority so she wouldn't have a coalition. Ah, uh, no, confounded, where could it be? Or worse, she gets to have a coalition with the Greens? The fucking far-left Greens? And, oh my god, like, honestly, New Zealand is a cucked nation. Like, it's never going to come back to normal. I mean, like, I'm really sorry, guys. But that's how I feel. Oh, sorry, folks, very sorry. I was looking for something and not watching where I was going. What now? Aren't you Mario? Why you you are? You're the Mario. Hello there. The name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. Um, I'm normally a letter per perfect postman, but I'm having a bit of trouble with a lost letter. Wouldn't you know it? I dropped it on Mount Rugged, and now I can't find it. If you happen to stumble upon a letter anywhere around here, please tell me. All right, my job could depend on it. I'll be searching this area thoroughly for a while. Oh, yeah. oh, I'm full health already, so I'm good. I'm gonna face some enemies so that I can get an upgrade for badges. Because I do need it. Yes. It's these Monty Moles, right? A Monty Mole, yep. And they're not that much. Because I'm gonna get an upgrade soon, I wanna make this quick. Actually, now, uh, since this is, that's not a lot of star points, I'm gonna probably... I'll, I'll conserve this, the flower stuff, so... Anyway... Oh, shit! Nice. Huh, <laughs> it's like whack-a-mole, you know? Oh, two damage, shit. Oh, okay. So I messed up before. I'm saving this because I'm going to give it away to someone, which I do need to do. Oh, look. Whack! Woo! I'm Wacka! Just another picture-perfect day at the top Mount Rugged. Woo! The sunshine, the fresh air is so refreshing. Wacka do. Whack out! Don't hit me! These are really valuable, by the way. I'm not, like, selling this. 
I lack a bump from Mount Rugged with Source 25 HP and 25 FP. Yeah, I'm definitely keeping it, that's for sure. These are very important. So anyway, so yeah, the, the cultural Marxist Jakina Ardern is, is running for, for re-election. I have a feeling that she is going to win it because, like, it's New Zealand. You know, I, obviously, I could say about, like, oh, fuck, I was trying to get to one of these guys, but then this happened. You know what? Uh... Or not now. Later. Yeah, I just gotta... Yeah, I gotta do this. So, you know... Yeah, she, she's probably gonna win re-election. And even the Conservative Party, like, I don't think they're even... Are they that good? Maybe. I mean, I could, like, endorse voting for the National Conservatives, but I don't know. Alright, good. Considering that they're... that I'm almost close to an upgrade, I'm going to... Yeah. I'm gonna, like, you know, do the, uh, explodey thing, so... Oh, I mean, there are three health, right? So I don't think I do need to do it. Or, maybe just do this. And then, do this. There we go. Oh, that's much faster. Upgrade. Now we get to do badge points. Nice. Let's see what we can upgrade. Okay. Power bounce. Let's see you do a power bounce. Uses three. Jumps on one enemy continuously until you miss an action command. Uh, no. Hammer throw. Let's see you use a hammer throw. Hits an enemy with a hammer no matter where the enemy is. Yeah, definitely. Give me. Alright, and is there- uh, I'm not gonna use this. HP plus FP. Dizzy attack. So I'm gonna keep the refund, because, you know, there's no good badges yet. Oh, and there's one. Alright. Oh, fuck. And we get this. A letter. So yeah, so you know another thing about New Zealand is that I really don't like how their electoral system. Obviously, it's way better than ours because we do the uh, the first past the post bullshit, and I'm really against that. Um, but you know they still have they have. Mixed, mem mixed member proportional representation where half of it is first past the post and the other is like, you know, um, the other is, oh shit, fuck, yeah, I'm not gonna face these guys, because they're very strong. I don't have like a hammer, super hammer kind of thing, so. Hold on, okay, I'm just checking, because there's, I have to get the nail, but I think I, there's a, to get to a, oh, star piece, I need it. Nice. Uh, nope. Okay, so we go back up. Oh shit! Fuck! These guys are strong. What are they called? Cleft. Yeah. Like in the old game. No, oh, fuck, I thought he would turn back into a rock. Alright, so... Yeah, honestly, they should get rid of the mixed member and just switch it to just party list, open party list proportional representation. Kind of like uh, Norway, because I actually looked 
based on their land size and even their population size, it's actually not that different, you know? They have a very small population, so they could just do just uh, open list, you know, proportional representation, you know? Oh, fuck. Jeez. Oh, I just want to get... Oh, another, another mushroom. Good. I'm probably going to use it at some point. Ah, oh, fuck. Huh? Oh yeah, that's perfect. Ooh, nice. You got the damage dodge badge. If you do the action command, decreases Mario's damage by one. Oh, that that could definitely come in handy. Oh, it's three. Yeah, if I turn off the thing, it's not gonna. Yeah, it's not gonna do much. Oh, okay. So yeah, they should change their electoral system because I feel like it just doesn't, you know, fit with, uh... Yeah, it just doesn't fit with the, um, the way the country is like, you know? Oh, fuck. Oh fuck, if that was going to be- Oh jeez! Oh, I'm gonna lose more coins, but that's okay, these guys are very hard to kill. Unless if I upgrade my hammer, which is not- Which is not really- Oh fuck, ignore it. Which is not now, unfortunately, but you know. Haha, <laughs> nice. I'm gonna get this letter. Oh shit, fuck. Okay, so... Yeah, I remember... Oh, they don't turn back into rocks. That's interesting. Ah, uh, fuck! It's just one guy, right? Okay, if it's maybe one, then why not I try doing this? Just so then I wouldn't run away from him. Okay, there we go. So I could do it like that, but you know, I just want to waste FP. Nice. Hmm. Uh, so I'll just have to go this way. Alright, let's go the other way. Anyway, so... Oh, shit. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I feel like if you switch to a party list proportional representation, it could be much better for your country, but, you know, so then there'd be more choices and stuff, but... You know, it, the way how it's set up, I feel like it's not... There's still two main parties. I mean, of course, there's also two main parties in Germany. They have a mix of proportional, but... Like, obviously, it's party list, but I'm only for party lists if the country is small and, you know, not that, um, like small, it has a small population and a small, uh, area size. The United States is not like that, so of course we'd have to use a mixed more proportional representation if there is one. Like, you know, half of it, not first past the post, but, um, like ranked choice voting by districts and also proportional by state or something like that. Maybe something similar to like Germany in a way, you know? I think there was only three of these, so I think I got all of them. Now we go back. Ah, oh, shit. Or... Whoa, what the hell? He, go he goes back, he goes down? That's not fair. Oh well. I'm running away. This guy's not worth much, so... Haha, <laughs> but now he's down. Yeah, that's right. Go this way. No, I don't know, fuck. Come on. And we go down. Oh fuck, come on, come on. 
<laughs> so it just does that. Mm, excuse me. So, let's see, where is he? Yep, put him here. And there he is. Oh, that's the one. Ah, uh, thanks for finding him. I'm so relieved. Uh, actually, I'm also looking for two other letters I may have lost. It wasn't my fault, really. If you find them, you could... Could you... Could you... Thank you. Uh, I couldn't read it. Fuck, I'm sorry. Oh, there we go. That's one of the uh, ones I dropped by accident. Uh, that thanks so much, really. Of course, there's still one more letter left. If all, if at all possible, could you please find it too? I'm really scouring this area of down, you know, down here. But so far, I haven't had much luck. Sorry if I wasn't reading very well. I, had, I just had something in my eye. I still kind of do, but you know, yeah. Anyway, okay. Letter. The last letter, you found it. Now I've got all the letters I've lost today. Oh, thank you so much. You're a lifesaver. I wish there were some way I could repay you for your help. Actually, to be honest, I haven't just lost letters on Mount Rugged. I may have sort of dropped some all over the Mushroom Kingdom while I was flying. Hehe, <laughs> yeah, you know, you're good at finding letters. Do you think you could keep an eye out during your travels? In return, I would offer you whatever help I can. Yes. Oh, praise the stars. I wasn't looking forward to having to find those letters all by myself. No, sir. I'll do my very best to help. You, you shall not regret this. Para can join your party. So there it is. He can fly you through short gaps. So yeah, I'm going to skip. Now onward. Oh, but hey, by the way, if you want to deliver a letter to someone, just speak to that person. I have to be next to you at... The, at the time for it to work though, so keep it in mind, alright? Alright, so now we go... I need to get some, like, stuff, so I want to, like, check around this area because there are areas where now I need to fly a short gaps to get special stuff, you know? By the way, this guy was my last partner to get because I was stuck on this level, so he was my last one. Yeah, so, just looking around, ooh, ah oh, fuck, I have too many items, but you know what, we're good with everything, and he's not gonna like this one, so, what is, what is this egg, restores 5 HP, oh, okay, but we don't need it, I'm gonna give the egg away to the guy anyway, so, Unknown origin. Anyway, so... Let's see. Let's talk to her, because she's the only creature. I saw a creature called a Waka on, on Mount Rugged. It was extra cute. Oh, I, I, I knocked him on the head to get his bum. Because his bumps are succulent. Anyway, so... That's what I'm saying. Maybe if this, if the country New Zealand has partyless proportional representation, maybe there'd be more, you know, political parties, and there wouldn't be, we would have Jakita Ar Ardern and stuff. But it is what it is. Unfortunately, she's gonna get reelected. Which I mean, it's, it's New Zealand's will actually. The, the people want it, and they're, they're all brainwashed like cultural Marxists in a way. Oh shit. Yeah. I'm definitely needing another. Fuck out, don't hit me. Okay. Yeah. So. Have the egg. 3 FP. Let's get rid of this one. <laughs> nice. I wasn't expecting to get two of these. But these are very important, so, you know. Anyway, so yeah, so 
I, I guess the one part, political party I'd probably vote for if I was in New Zealand is the ACT party, because they're very libertarian-ish and stuff, and they're probably for free speech. So that's the political party I would vote for. Not national. And then New Zealand first, I thought there would also be a political party I could probably vote for, but they kind of cucked out like supporting Jakita Ardern instead of the national party, the national party coalition, so I wouldn't vote for them. Like, they, they fucked New Zealand in a way. Quake hammer bag, suddenly damages all enemies on the ground or ceiling. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need it. But how much does it need? Ooh, it needs just one. Perfect. Definitely having it. I could just fall to the ground, but you know, it's just more convenient this way. Anyway, there is a star piece at that area, you know, that I've been to before. Oh, I need to go. I need to go that way and get that seed. That's definitely something I need to do. You have to do actually. Ignore him? Oh, fuck, yes. Huh. You're not gonna catch me. Catch me. Huh. You're talking to me? I don't see anyone else here. Alright, you are talking to me. It's been a long while since I first came here from my home in Flower Fields, but you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. Nobody ever notices me. The few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. I love a good conversation. Here, take this as thanks. This is a precious seed. Keep it well and remember me. Got a magical seed, yeah. Please grow my seed with care. I'll help you in one day. Yeah, I think it'll help you one day, I think. He is right, so... Anyway, so anyway, so... Yeah, so I'll probably just vote for the ACT party. Hopefully, maybe they'd, they'd probably do some good, but we'll see. Anyway. Ignore him. You gotta get to the uh, to that star because I'm collecting as many star pieces as, as I can because they get you good badges. Anyway, yeah. So going the right way. Oh shit! Fuck. Oh god. Ignore him. Here we go. And just do this. Star piece. Alright. Now we continue onward. I'm sorry if I was roaming around, but like it's a Paper Mario game I have to. And you know, you gotta get as much stuff as you can. Oh yeah, I know I could just use the spin dash just to make things faster, but I don't know. I'm fine walking normal, you know? Fuck! Oh, that was close. You saw that? Jeez. Ignore him. Yes. Doing good so far. Is there a save block down here? No, I thought there was. But you know what, I'll go- I'll continue like this. Because there is going to be a little- Hold on. Yeah, it's an hour and 35. There's gonna be a little small battle here, and I'm going to do it. Because I want to get those star points. I'm more powerful than I used to- I mean... I know how to play this game, like, compared to back then, so I'm definitely gonna fight- do this fight. Hey there, hold up a sec, partner. Just a darn minute, I've seen you somewhere. And plus I could maybe use those items, you know, so that I wouldn't, you know, be full or something. Yep, very similar. You look a lot like this feller Mario who's on Bowser's Wanted poster. Now give, now give, what's your name? Mario. Mario, well I'll be. If you're Mario, I reckon I've got to bust you up. Oh, he should, I should have talked like King DDD, you know? Wanna clobber that bear Kermit? Or, I'll kick that Kermit to the curb, or surely you just... I, 
I fucking love King DDD's voice I mean, before I didn't like it that much, but now I kind of do. His dubbing was really good, I have to admit. Anyway. So now we have to- we have to fight him. I'm full everything, so I'm good. Buzzer. Oh, that's his name, huh? Oh, fuck. Oh, well. Shell shot. Yeah, definitely. Use our most power- Oh, it's a very strong attack. Nice. Oh, I don't really remember do, do, doing this. Oh, shit! Holy- I, I did not know it could, I, that this happens. Wow. Okay, so two turns. Uh, can I change partner? I don't think I can. But you know, let's let's continue onward. Yes. Oh fuck. Oh jeez, fuck! Holy shit, he's actually pretty strong. I have to, I have to admit. Okay, and now we, we have to... I mean, I could use this, but... No, we need to be full. Let's use a, a whack a bump. whack a bump. yes. Get some money out of it. <laughs> That's kind of gross how he just eats the bump and everything, I don't know. Nice. Oh fuck. Ah, oh, nice! Uh huh, I'm getting good at it. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh well, it wasn't that bad actually. Uh. Ring low. I think now's a good time to use this. So what it does is just gives you 5 HP and 5 FP. I don't know what it's called, refresh? I don't know. Oh fuck. Oh, I'm so close! It's like a long draw. Okay, I'm gonna save just for the shell attack, you know? Okay. There we go! Huh! I did it! He was very hard back then, I died on him before, but it's obvious. Yeah, I got whooped! Ha, <laughs> there he goes. You can literally just not fight him, just say you're Luigi and then you're good, but... I want to test my skill and see how strong I am compared to a long time ago, you know, back then when I used to die on him. And I am stronger, so that's good. Ah, <sighs> good. Perfect. Just what I need. It doesn't refill the star thing, but that's okay. So here we are, Dry Dry Desert. Well, hello there, old boy. How goes the travels, eh? I'm known as Colorado. I'm an archaeologist, you know, I travel the world. At the moment, I'm turning Dry Dry Desert upside down to find the Dry Dry Ruins. My, my assistants have attempted to gather information in Dry Dry Outpost, which is near here. Sadly, as of yet, we're having a little su success. All I need's a clue and we'll be golden. You're Colorado, correct? And named Paracari, I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter duly delivered, a postman's job is never done. Oh, good show. It's a letter from my wife. 
Thank you ever so old chap, this is just what I needed to give me strength to go on. I know, I'll pass this along as, as a spot of thanks. I came across it a while while I was immersed in a dig around here. Oh, star piece. To get to the desert town Dory Dory outpost, just to go due east on that on this path. It, I'd be careful not to stray from the path if I were you. You may find some trouble and you'll definitely get lost. Even the path isn't that safe, so watch out for enemies. <laughs> Excuse me. We're assisting Professor Colorado. Right now we're waiting on the guy who hiked over to Dry Dry Outpost to try to bring back some information. Did you know the people of Dry Dry Outpost are descendants of the makers of Dry Dry Ruins? What a cool thought, huh? People have been living here, watching ever, uh, ever over the ruins for many generations. Oh, hello there, old boy. How goes the travels, eh? I know it's... I already read it. Oh, okay, it's just, it, it's just an NPC talking point. Look at that genie lamp. <laughs> so yeah, you know, playing this level also reminds me of Syria because, you know, desert and all that stuff. I always associated Egypt with, with Syria back then, but it's, it's completely different. Although, to be fair, um, Syria used to be a part of Egypt, I think, in 1958, and for... Or 1957, I think, because it was part of Egypt for three years, but then... Oh shit, avoid the tornado. But then they split off. Was, were, were they Egypt? I don't know if it was 1958 or 1957, I don't know. Hello, fellow travelers. I'm in the middle of a journey, just as you appear to be. Other travelers I meet are like brothers and sisters to me. If a town is what you seek, follow this path to the east. A desert town called Dry Dry Outpost waits at the path's end. Oh, shit. I'm never fighting these guys because they steal. Welcome to Dredger Outpost. And here we are. Alright, I'm gonna play this little game here. So we can get a star piece. Kawiz! Chuck Quiz Quizmo's the name and quizzes are my game. You want quizzes? I got them. If you can manage to answer my brain busting question correctly then, yeah, 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 who? I'll give you a star piece. Want to try this quiz? Yes. Then let's go to the question. Question. What is the name of Gumbario's younger sister? Gumba... Gum, Gumbalina? Gumbaria. Nice! Correct! Congratulations! Here is your star piece. Yeah, you've correctly answered one question so far. Good luck next time. Well, well, so long. Farewell till we meet again. Oh jeez. Alright. So, uh, oh, whoa. Let's follow him for a sec, because I wanna, you know, um, just, just check where, where this leads and stuff, and then I'll, I'll call it off. But that was actually supposed to give you a hint of what this is. So he just goes back in and he acts like you've never seen him before. Welcome, traveler. This is the renowned little Ma mouser's shop of Dry Dry Outpost. What can we interest you in? Yeah, so... That's just like a little hint or of some sorts, basically. Anyway, uh, let me talk to this one guy, you know, because, hey, hello, I'm assisting an archaeologist, Professor Colorado. I came to Dredger out to ex excavate to Dredger Ruins, but it's hot as blazes every day and I'm constantly thirsty. I want to quit and go home. I was you can't find the information. Radar anyway, it's vital that I find where we get a clue. I want to think about how bad a professor will be if I go back with nothing. What, what am I going to do? I was sitting here because I heard that there is an important clue about- yeah. So it's just traditional shit, like NPC stuff. Alright, so I'm gonna- 
I'm gonna call it off here. It's an hour 46, so this should be good. So yeah, I talked what I need to say about University of South Florida and stuff and the New Zealand election. I'm, I mean, like, it's gonna happen, but I'm not looking forward to it. You know, I was so sad when Justin Trudeau was re-elected. I was hoping Andrew Scheer or would would win with a majority. Maxine Bernier would get some seats and maybe form form a coalition, but. That didn't happen, unfortunately. And as a matter of fact, Trudeau has to get some votes from the new Democrat, the cultural Marxist New Democratic Party. So, I mean, like, Canada's fucked in a way, but then again, like, not as fucked as New Zealand, which is gonna happen, unfortunately. But anyway, oh, wait, let me, let me save one more time, because, I don't know, I just want to be sure. But yeah, so I'm just gonna end it off here. I've said everything, and I said about University of South Florida. Hopefully, maybe I could get in, and if not, then I'll just move to somewhere else and stuff, and, you know, we'll see what happens. So yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time!